The court made the final call today in the case of Daryl J. Guerrero, who pled guilty to possession of 50 or more grams of meth with intent to distribute. During the hearing, the court addressed a series of Paytel phone calls that were suspected to be drug-related transactions made while detained at the Department of Corrections. In the calls, Guerrero mentioned DVDs valued at $150, which is consistent with the price of gram of meth. In other calls between him and an outside individual, he mentioned the street slang G, which means grams, and to pack five Gs and deliver it in exchange for $500. Assistant U.S. Attorney Laura Sambataro argued, quote, they're not referring to DVDs, they're referring to drugs. And that $150 for a DVD? That's not a DVD. You're not breaking DVDs in half. However, defense counsel Jay Ariola stated that the root of the problem is addiction. His federal charges stemmed January of last year when he was arrested after an incident occurred at Leo Palace Resort in Jotnia. According to court documents, Guerrero was found unresponsive by resort staff, causing management to call police for assistance. Upon arrival, GPD officers saw Guerrero on the couch, and in plain view were multiple bags containing a large amount of meth. Officers also saw a large amount of money in which GPD secured the room and contacted the feds. Chief Judge Francis Tidenko Gatewood stated, quote, Day after day, we see nice-looking young men getting in trouble into drugs. What happened along the way? Guerrero simply stated that it's because of his addiction. She commended him for recognizing his drug problem and that it's the first step in recovery. Guerrero, a first-time offender, was sentenced to 70 months in prison with credit for time served. The court also made a judicial recommendation that he be held at the Sheridan, Oregon prison. Once he completes his time, he will have three years of supervised release. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Tyler Matsunani.